All right, for one of your assignments this week, I want you to try to record yourselves reciting your poem, Afternoon on a Hill, okay? And there is a way to do this entirely within BrightThinker using the same built-in camera that you've been using when we do our Google Meets, that camera that's built into your computer. When you go into the assignment, there's a way to record yourself within the assignment to do this. So I want you to watch carefully what I do. Okay, so I'm gonna share my screen. All right, and I'm going to hide this. Go into the student app, okay? Your poem and where we do our poetry is in literature. So hit your play button for your activities in literature. Okay, there is one that's called Poetry Video Recording of Afternoon on a Hill. Click on that. It's going to bring you to this page that you've seen before, right? But I give you directions. Please use the camera feature on your assignment to record yourself reciting the poem Afternoon on a Hill. Normally, what you do when you submit something this way, I've told you to hit this plus sign and then attach a file, right? You're not going to do that this time. Do you see where it says add your comments here? Okay, you're going to click there. When you click inside that box, a whole series of things pops up within that box. If you notice all the way over on the right, here's YouTube video, you don't want that. See this little video camera looking thing? That is to insert a video. So you're going to click on that and it's going to pop up this box, okay? And you're going to say that, yes, you want to record a video. When you are ready, now I can't show you what this will look like entirely because I'm using my camera right now to video myself making this tutorial, okay? And I'll have two videos. So normally when you are looking at it, you would see your face right there, okay? So when you're ready, you would click on this green button that says record you will have three minutes. So it will only record up to three minutes, which is plenty of time to recite your poem. So you would recite it within three minutes. When you're done, you would hit stop. You'd see a stop button. And then you would submit your work. So once you do that, it would post that video right here. And then you will click submit my work. When you submit your work like that, your recording will come to me and I will be able to pull it up and watch your video in my grade book, okay? So I would like to start doing our poetry recitations in this way from now on, doing video recordings, okay, instead of just taking turns in class. We still may do one or two where we do it in class, but because there's so many of you, reciting them when we only have two hours live is really difficult. So again, you're going to, I'll walk you back through this one more time. You're on your main home screen. Go to literature, click the play button. Go all the way down, these are all your assignments. Click poetry video recording of Afternoon on a Hill and push your play button. Bring up this and it'll tell you use the camera feature on your assignment to record yourself reciting the poem. So you're going to click add your comments here. Just click in this box. And remember all these things pop up and one of them looks like a camera. You press that to insert a video. Then you press record. It will record you making your video and you will just say Afternoon on a Hill by Edna St. Vincent. Malay, and you will continue to recite that and you end it with the same title and author and then submit your assignment. Try it out and see if you can figure out how to do that because I think this will be a fun way of doing your poetry recitations. If you mess up, guess what? Hit cancel and do it again and that's okay. Pick your best one and then submit it. All right, I hope that helps. Give it a try. I can't wait to see your videos.